So whether you're a bargain shopper or looking for a few new pieces to update your wardrobe, or you're just tired of looking at a closet full of clothes and accessories that you just aren't wearing anymore, there are so many ways to buy and sell clothes these days, from apps to websites. You don't even need to leave your house to make some money off your wardrobe or to get a great deal. So with more, I'm joined by fashion expert Alexis Hans. Great to see you. Nice to see you too. I love the idea of this segment because it fits into where I think a lot of people are at. Stuff you want to get rid of or you want to add, but really you don't want to spend a whole lot of money. Last year, resale grew faster than retail. And I imagine that in 2020, that trend will continue. Um, the pandemic, of course, is part of that change in the industry. For sure. The pandemic really has made us look at our shopping habits. So I think we all of a sudden we're sitting at home looking at our closets full of clothes that we're not wearing. And people are thinking, I'm wasting a lot of money on brand new clothes. So now they're also looking that they don't want to waste their money, but they also don't want these clothes to land, land, end up in landfills as mm -hmm. well. So resale is kind of like an eco-conscious way of shopping nowadays. People love it. It's addicting. I'm all for it. Okay. You are an expert on the topics because you yourself sell your clothing using some of the apps that you're going to share with us. So when did you start doing it? Is it hard? And why do you love it? <laughs> no, it's super simple. I started selling through these new kind of resale apps about two months into the pandemic. So I w went from actually three closets down to one closet. I really edited my closet. I had piles and piles of clothes. And I normally went to the consignment shops that had the brick and mortar stores. They were closed. So I looked online. I started selling online. And I won't go back. Okay, can you can you get like decent quote unquote decent money for your things? <laughs> you know what? You can price whatever you want to sell it at. So yes, you can for sure. A lot of these places, you actually will input the price, and they're going to immediately tell you what you're going to get for it at the very end. So I made, you know, I'm not going to brag, but I sold a lot of clothes over the last couple of months. Okay, I have a, I have a question, a follow-up question about different kinds of clothes, but let's talk about the <laughs> apps first. You use Poshmark, so how does it work, and who's it for? Because it sounds like it would be more expensive brands. Okay, you know what? It's actually the opposite. So Poshmark's my number one place to sell. I love the brand and the app. So this one is for fast fashion brands. So you think about Zara, Lululemon, Aritzia, those kind of those kind of brands really fly off the website. It's really fun. It's almost like a game. You can like photos, comment on photos. You can barter, counter offer. You can bundle items together and actually get a discount. So if you want to buy a couple items from one seller, you can say, hey, I'll buy three items instead of one. Can I get a deal? Wow. Okay. The next one is called VSP consignment. This is for some more of that high end fashion. Definitely. So I get asked a lot about where to sell my designer clothes because people are spending thousands of dollars on designer clothes. So when they resell it, they don't want to sell it for really cheap. So VSP, a Canadian company, they have stores, but they also sell online. This is where you're not going to be able to sell everything. They're going to look at your clothes and pick what they want, but they authenticate every item. So you know that they're going to take really good care of it and they have a customer base to buy the items. And if you're going to buy from them, you know that if it's a Chanel purse, it's really a Chanel purse. All right, one that's very popular because you get 100% of the profits is Facebook Marketplace. And for those who aren't familiar with how it works, walk us through it. Okay, well, I love it because of the accessibility. We all have Facebook, pretty much everyone I know is on it. So you just go to Facebook Marketplace, you click the link, and you can search by area. So this is what it's really good for. Let's say you live in Mississauga, you can search Mississauga Buy and Sell. They also have brand groups, so you can find a Zara Buy and Sell. But the thing is here, no one is helping you sell it. So you are going to get 100% of the profits, but you do have to take the time to physically meet the person and exchange the item and get paid. So I always say, don't make it too hard on yourself. Get them to meet you at the grocery store or when you're out and about doing errands so that you don't waste too much time on it. I have friends and family who use Facebook Marketplace for things like snowsuits for kids for the winter, and they love it. Uh, the it's last, amazing. Yeah, the last one um, is Instagram Stories. So how do you sell your clothes there? <laughs> I know this one I was kind of hesitant to sell on Instagram stories, but it does so well. So what you do, we're kind of already showing our lives. We're showing us edit the closet. So the next step was to start selling the clothes right on Instagram stories. You just post a picture of the item with the size and the price you want to sell it at. And the first person to DM you gets it. And I really feel that there's like a sense of urgency with it because the stories are only up for 24 hours. So they kind of think, oh, I have to have it. It might be gone. I might never get it. So you make a lot of sales on Instagram stories that way. This is such great information to have, especially heading into the weekend because, you know, it gives us something to do on a Saturday. Alexis, thanks so much. <laughs> All great tips. Good to see you. Thank you. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.